help support our coverage with a free account on Privacy, the service that keeps your bank information private when shopping online. Get $5 right now to try the service at PluckHitsLive.com slash privacy. Hello, Internet. I'm Scott with Pluck Hits Live, part of the Tech Podcast Network. We are here at CES 2019 at the Intel booth. I've got a TV and some VR stuff behind me. We'll find out about that in a second, but first, go ahead and introduce yourself for me. Hi, I'm Lindsay Setch, and I'm Marketing Programs Manager at Intel. Fantastic. And uh, what is it we're, we're looking at here today? Well, we're looking at the new generation of Wi-Fi called Wi-Fi 6. And Wi-Fi 6 is a big deal because it not only delivers really fast performance that you would expect, but also significantly reduces latency. So it's more responsive for applications like gaming, gaming. and <laughs> VR. And it's also designed for very connected environments where you've got lots of devices connecting to your network. So obviously we know that uh, there's a lot, of more, a lot more connected devices. We've got smart homes and light switches are connecting to Wi-Fi now. So being able to consistently connect more devices is important. Exactly. People are looking for fast Wi-Fi connectivity, reliable Wi-Fi connectivity, and connectivity that's really responsive. And that's exactly what Wi-Fi 6 will deliver. Uh, from the Intel standpoint, we're delivering Wi-Fi 6 chips for the PC this year, and we're also delivering them for home routers and gateways. Okay. It's really important to have that technology on both the PC side as well as on the network side so that you can get that best experience. Yeah, because connecting a Wi-Fi 6 powered computer to a, a router that in old terms, 802.11ac, but Wi-Fi 5 now, uh, you're still going to be at 5 because the, the least of <laughs> is what you get maxed out at. Yep, exactly. <laughs> to get the maximum benefit and potential of Wi-Fi 6, which is based on the 802.11ax standard, you'll want to have it in both your devices and also in your the network you're connecting to. So. In, uh, in practice, <laughs> we've got VR back here, and so uh, in addition to the latency, like where, do, where does the, the Wi-Fi 6 come in here? Yeah, so what we're showing here is a PC with Intel's Wi-Fi 6 that's connected to an Intel-based Wi-Fi 6 router, and we're running that VR game on the PC, and really what we're showing is the benefits of both the improved performance as well as the low latency to deliver that really high-quality VR experience, and if you have a chance to check it out, it's very smooth, no hiccups, no stuttering, no lags. Well, let's take a look at that. So uh, obviously VR got a whole lot better <laughs> with less latency. Um, for those of us who would like this at home, what kind of time frame are we looking at on a rollout for this? So you should expect to start seeing PCs as well as routers with this technology in the first half of 2019. And you'll have a bunch of choices with new PCs, new routers and gateways based on Intel Wi-Fi 6 in the 2019 time frame. Fantastic. Well, I really appreciate you taking the time to talk today. Great. Thank you very much. For continuing CES 2019 coverage, stay tuned to PluckHitsLive.com slash CES.